One of CapCut's built-in features uh, is automated uh, subtitles and automated uh, speech to text, and it's actually very effective and really simple to use. I'm gonna show you guys real quick uh, how to do that. So if you have your CapCut project open uh, here, right on your uh, dashboard, I have my entire uh, video um, laid out. Now you can do this multiple ways. You can do this piece by piece, but I have all my text pretty much laid out in my video here. Um, and so I'm ready for it. Uh, as far as the narration, it's completely done. And so I normally, when I do this, um, wait till the very end of the project, uh, when I've got everything laid out and everything's, um, uh, already done and so it does the whole thing at one time but you can do it in any other way but in the top left hand uh, space of your uh, project file up here where it has these icons for menu items for editing uh, the one you're going to click is text and once you click text you'll see the options here and you'll actually see right down here auto captions so when you click on auto captions um, this gives you the option to create auto captions uh, for your entire project. Um, it, it does have other language options as well. So you can create auto captions for multiple languages if you wanted to. Um, so obviously, we're, I'm just going to select English here. Uh, but that is an amazing feature and it is very, very um, effective. And so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on Create. Um, and that's it. You just click create and then it starts to do it. Now, I did this already with the project to help speed this process up. Uh, but right now it is generating auto captions. It takes a little bit depending on the length of your project and how long um, it actually is. And so I'm going to uh, wait here uh, for this to load. Boom. And there we are. And as you can see, um, it has fully loaded across my project um, that little red line it falls right into your project and that's the length of your text and sometimes it's uh, very effective sometimes uh, it misses a spot like right here as I start when I click play it got the text right but then it stops even though right here I am still talking so what I have to do is go in here and grab this little text box and just extend it to right where my next speech starts boom so that way I've got it and it clicks automatically. So I was very, very impressed with how effective this actually is. It is very, very uh, efficient. I found um, uh, one or two uh, slight uh, misinterpretations. So make sure that you do watch the video all the way through and you read the text so you know that you're getting the correct uh, captions. That's probably going to be one of the difficulties if you do try to use it uh, for the benefit of translating it into another language. If you can't uh, read that language, then uh, you'll have a hard time ensuring that uh, the project is correctly translated. However, um, it is it is extremely efficient and very good. And so I was very surprised, well surprised at how good it was. So I hope that this uh, video helped you out. I hope that you were able to uh, utilize that. If it did help you out, please take the time to like, share, subscribe, comment, all that stuff really, really helps the channel. And I really appreciate it. If you have any other questions, uh, please let me know in the comment section below. Um, I normally will go through those uh, comments and see uh, about possibly creating a video if there are some issues you're running into and you need some help with. All right, guys, I will catch you in the next one.